Butterfly gon' recap this and say God he caught a 30 on the dime road. So all y'all wanna know what happened, I'ma tell you what happened. He got smoked. That was crazy out there. Thomas Peter, nobody that knows body. Hit his area with 51. Everything in the fire flies. When you start rapping like that. Cas, 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 cas. Huh? So you already know what it is. Salute to every single one of y'all. Whoop de whoop. Follow me on IG, you know who I be all that. Yeah, yeah. Cas. I don't know if y'all seen Cassidy's Hip Hop is real interview where he was talking about. The potential battle with Freeway, you know, it was announced that the, I think it was the Drake card almost like a year ago. The battle still hasn't happened. But it's like everybody battling everybody and they setting up this nigga versus this nigga. It's supposed to be the best, supposed to be a rebuttaler versus a rebuttaler. It's supposed to be a this versus this. It's supposed to be a nigga that got beat up versus a nigga that got beat up before. It's like none of this shit ain't working. It's like, what is y'all doing? And Cass is like, what the fuck is going on? Like, I will tell you this, right? <laughs> when it comes to Cass, he's one of the most entertaining. Like, if you watch Cassidy interview, you could never watch it all in one because he is one of those people that's gonna, he's the energy, the energy, the wave. You've seen what him versus Hitman did, greatest face off in battle rap probably ever. Um, probably still doing numbers to this day. Is that the only million view face off or whatever the case might be? Because you know, all of that shit goes on YouTube, URL shit goes on the app. Um, so Cass is like, they've been trying to book a battle forever to try to recreate the energy, and they book people like this person's dog bit that person's dog, so they need the battle. This person's gay, this person's gay, so they need the battle. This person beat up this person, so they need like it's he has a crazy funny way of saying the most normal, regular sh But, see the thing is, Cass, you were just being used as a chess piece. This is like a ruse here. They had you thinking that they want you to battle Freeway, but you and Freeway was actually only booked to stop you from booking, battling Charlie Clips on Rare Breed Entertainment. That's all that was about. See, they see them up the street doing that. They don't like that shit. I'm telling you. See, Cass got to understand URL and RVE are not friends. They are enemies. And they will cut each other's legs from under each other at any given moment. That's why you've seen what Mook was saying in all of his footage when he was talking about booking cards on the same day and paying people not to battle and all this other crazy shit because it's happened before. You know what I'm saying? Uh, these, these battles do get booked and I've literally seen people or heard of people getting paid. How long the Don told you niggas? Come on, I, who am I? I'm just a nigga with a camera. Oh, well, well, well. Oh, yeah, it's a nice shirt. Rest in peace, Big L. But yeah, I, I just call it like I call it. So me telling you doesn't isn't going to equate to much than shit that you already know. Um, so here's the deal. Like I said, I when NBS, Nothing But Sports, had posted yesterday, that Cass was uh, ready to battle and are we ready for the battle and I had wrote pass. The reason why I wrote pass is because number one, it's not a battle, nobody asked for that. You know what I'm saying? Like nobody. And it's not even more so Cassidy's fault. Cassidy been in one, two, three battles already. You know, we know what Cassidy's gonna bring. He's gonna bring an entertainment face off. The battle will be good. He, 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 the battle will be cool. It won't be great, but it'll be all right. You know what I'm saying? He doesn't have great battles. Uh, he battled Ars, he battled Goods, he battled uh, Hitman. I've seen all three. If you're not like in the Cassidy fan club or you're not like an enthusiast, you'll be able to break down bars and call it the way you call it so you don't spoil it. And the Hitman shit to most, you know, a lot. Some had Hitman winning, some had Cass winning. It was pretty debatable. Hitman was supposed to, what Hitman said in the battle is the reason why people, some people will have Cass is because Hitman said, I will make it so niggas do not want to book you no more. You will never get booked again. I'm going to destroy you. And that didn't happen. So since that didn't happen, you give somebody a chance to come back, come back, come back again. Now the Charlie Clips shit is interesting because I feel like Charlie Clips would draw, show the clear separation. Goods didn't do it, Ars didn't do it, Holla ain't do it, Clips will do it. So when it comes to Freeway, it's like bro, Freeway wasn't a good battle rapper back then. Like when he battled, I got two kids, two mouths to feed. Like that shit when he was like, Ain't nobody messing with the freeway, nobody. And I got a lot of respect for free. I fuck with free. But back in the days, like we was on Rockefeller and High 97 and battling niggas and shit, he was not a good battle rapper then. You know what I'm saying? He had some shit, but he was not a battle rapper per se. I wouldn't say that he was like 
some battle rapper that was feared or whatever. It was never that. You know what I'm saying? Niggas respect free for what he did on the freestyles, what he did on the radio, and shit like that. But as far as like a battle rapper, no. Niggas fear Joel Ortiz, Royce the Five Nine, and a lot of them niggas first before they fear um, a freeway. So, like I said, a battle of this magnitude is like, I guess. It's not even Floyd Mayweather versus Manny Pacquiao. And I say that from the perspective of a battle or a fight that people wanted to see, but when it happened, it happened way too late, so it didn't even live up to the hype. This battle will not live up to the hype regardless of how it's pushed, regardless, it will not. That's the reason why it hasn't happened yet. Now, even if it could, you could put it on a Philly card, people are gonna watch it, people are gonna talk about it, people will recap it. I'm gonna recap it anyway, you know what I'm saying? Every time this camera cut on, cha-ching, so I'm gonna recap it anyway. But is it what the fans want? No, it's not what the fans want. They're not asking for this shit. I haven't seen one person say, I cannot wait. Yo, I, I literally looked at when I tweeted past. I just tweeted past and I looked at, started looking at the comments and every, I didn't see a single person that was like, yo, you bugging, I wanna see. Everybody was like, no, no, pass, don't wanna see it, yada, yada, yada. And like I said, it's no disrespect to Cass, cause Cass got better in his last battle versus Hitman Holla. Is he like URL level? No. Is he top tier battle rep? No, he's not. But that's just my personal opinion. He probably has, he does have his core audience that's gonna watch regardless. The man has albums that went platinum, so motherfuckers is gonna watch. And he he's entertaining as fuck. His interviews, funny as hell. He calls it how he calls it. He don't, he don't spare niggas feelings. Even regardless of the league and shit like that, he will be like, I could do business with anyone. I'm gonna I'm make my money anywhere. I got paid before uh, I even announced that the battle was happening. That's the type of deals you get in with Cass. Yeah, you gotta pay me something before I even get on this motherfucking flight or get on this stage to say that this battle is happening. That's just the type of person he is. But. Cass, I, I, I'm gonna be honest with you, the battle hasn't happened yet because nobody's looking for it. You was only booked so you wouldn't battle Charlie Clips on your, on RB. The only reason why, I, I don't see no other reason why. Nobody was asking for this battle, nobody was checking for it. Once you got hot, I'm gonna say hot, on RBE, last summer with the max out, you know what I'm saying, the fucking where was I, and it's in the bag and all of that. Niggas don't be liking niggas, like, you ever like, okay, so you know if you, if you talk to more than one chick at the same time, you know what I'm saying, you got bitches and shit. So you got a main girl, you know what I'm saying, your girl, you taking her on trips, and you buying and shit, and you, you know what I'm saying, piping her up. Side bitch gonna see that shit, whether she see it on the gram, whether she use a friend's gram to see your shit, whether she, however she see it, she gonna see it. She gonna feel the type of way, you ain't doing shit for me, you ain't taking me nowhere, you ain't doing shit for me, woody woody woo. So a nigga gonna be like, all right, cool. Just to shut this motherfucker up, we gonna, I'm gonna do a little something. That, a lot of niggas is like that. That's basically what URL did. Yo, we gonna try to make, we gonna throw something at you so you won't battle over there. You know what I'm saying? Cause what a bitch will do is she'll be like, oh, well you ain't doing nothing. I'm about to start dating. The bitch gonna tell you she gonna start dating. You like, for what? Like we got a vibe, shit is good. Like what you doing? I, I need more. I'm gonna start dating. That's exactly what this situation looks like, my nigga. Cash did good somewhere else and niggas don't wanna see that shit again. I told y'all niggas a long time ago, niggas wanna see you doing good, but not better than them. You see this shit in every competitive aspect, even in the working world. A nigga at your job will want you to do good, but he will not want you to, to do better than them. I've seen niggas not show people things at the job or show them halfway because you feel like they're a threat to you. You know what I'm saying? That's, and, and I don't blame Cass because Cass is a battle rapper. Cass is a, is a legend in, in rap and in freestyle and in battle rap. Yes, he is. Is he the same as when he first came out? No, he's not. But at the same time, he still has the name. He's still the person. Is he entertaining as fuck? Yes. Is he gonna have a great face off? Yes. Is he gonna do numbers? Yes. He's gonna do two, three, four million. And Cass battles don't go on no app. If he battled, that shit is coming out on YouTube. Now, it'll probably go on the app too, but it is going to come out on YouTube. There are certain people that when they shit drop, they shit gotta go on YouTube. Fuck all this app and you will do what No, that shit is coming out. But as far as Cass goes, I would not be surprised if this battle never happened. If it never happened, I wouldn't be surprised. If they just chalked it up as a loss, like fuck it. Like how Houston Rockets did uh, John Wall. Just paid him and said fuck it, go home. It is what it is, and now he's on the Clippers. But um, yeah, I, I, I see Cass concerned and wondering why the battle hasn't happened. You just, you, you're in the new age. This is how shit goes. Niggas do shit like this. Axe Hollow to Don, you know what I'm saying? They got 26 bands to not battle murder, move on RBE. That's saying enough. You basically 
was was try paid to try to eliminate them from having the main card big stage events. It's like, oh, whoa, whoa, hell no. If we could pay you to make you not, if niggas could have paid you to not battle Hitman after the Hitman battle was booked, that shit would have happened. You wouldn't have battled Hitman. You would have just got paid and that card would have been ruined. Niggas would rather see the, the destruction of the, of the next business before seeing them niggas succeed. And it, they will, niggas will pay real money for it. Niggas will pay real money, like real money, $5,000, 10000 15000 $20,000, $100,000, or however much. And Cass is the highest paid battle rapper in the world. So you paying him house money to not battle. And then when you book him, the battle still ain't happened a year later. If they wanted this shit to happen, it would have happened already. It's just my personal opinion. You already know. Gang.